Well, the main message from the folks holding this press conference to everybody else today is they are outraged, they are disgusted, and you should be too. The three women, along with their attorney and the woman who lives on this block, whose home they say that they were trying to protect, all spoke to reporters today. They are all active in their community associations, and they are all now plaintiffs in a class action lawsuit that they have filed against BG and E. That's according to the information that was shared at this press conference. They spoke with reporters, they said, after being arrested and held overnight for 16 to 17 hours for protesting BG and E's installation of new gas regulators outside the buildings in this historic neighborhood and for shutting off gas service to customers who declined to have that equipment installed. The group called the actions of BGE and city leaders bullying. We deserve better. Baltimore City residents deserve better. The fact that those resources were used for a private company to bully their way through an unlawful action, we should all be outraged. I just feel like we're being strong armed. We were peacefully protesting. If these charges don't get dropped, uh, the criminal justice system will literally laugh them out of court. Um, we, we have carjackings and robberies dropped every day in Baltimore City. Uh, these are the three charges that we're going to take forward. Uh, all of us need to have a different conversation. These folks have been organizing to be clear, there are fines and jail time associated with these charges, and all three women have a court date later this summer. We have reached out to BG&E for comment on the new lawsuit that was filed and the allegations that, was, that were made against the company at this press conference. We have yet to hear back. The company did reply to 11 News on Thursday. Most recently via email, an email that reads in part, BGE's placement of regulators on the outside of properties rather than inside is meant to enhance system safety and reliability. BGE is modernizing its gas system by replacing its aging low pressure gas infrastructure with a higher pressure system. BGE also claims that it will and has been continuing to answer any questions or concerns that residents who are affected may have, but that's not what some residents here told us today. More on that coming up tonight at 10 and 11 o'clock. Reporting live from Federal Hill tonight, I'm Kate Amara, WBA.